Hi, this is Peter Morgan from the DJPodcast.com. In this video for Wink Sound, we're going to be looking at how to set up your MIDI controller with Native Instruments Tractor Pro 2. Let's start off by opening up the preferences. To do that, we can simply click on the cogwheel icon up in the top right. Then, you want to make sure that you're set to the controller manager, as this is where you can assign mappings to your MIDI controller and keyboard. If Tractor hasn't already detected your MIDI controller, you're going to need to go and tell Tractor what type of controller you're using. To do this, you want to click on the Add button near the top. We're presented with a couple different options here. The first is generic keyboard, if you want to make a new mapping for your keyboard on your computer. Next, you can choose generic MIDI, if you want to create your own custom mapping and not use one of the presets the Tractor Pro 2 has built in. If you're using something like the Control S4, or a Pioneer CDJ2000, you can simply go ahead and choose one of the presets the Tractor Pro 2 already has built in. Finally, if you're going to use a TSI file that was generated by another Tractor Pro 2 user or supplied by your MIDI controller's manufacturer, you can simply choose Import and select the TSI file that contains all of the custom mappings for your controller. Once you've selected the particular controller that you want to use, you want to make sure that the import is set to your particular controller. Because I'm just showing you the keyboard shortcuts, you'll see that the import is set to keyboard. Below in the assignment table, we have a list of all of the mapped functions. You can go in and select any of these to edit them, or you can add your own custom mappings to configure Tractor to your liking, as that will allow you to unlock all of the features in Tractor Pro 2 right at your fingertips. Check out more of my videos at thedjpodcast.com. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology.